Hey, race fans, I'm Wiley Wade. Thanks for joining me for another edition of Wiley's Race Report. This last Saturday night, April 24th, 2018, we had five divisions in action at Antioch Speedway. The Antioch Hardtops, the Dwarf Cars, the Hobby Stocks, the Late Models, and the Living Fat B Mods. The Hardtop main event had two cars make it to it, with Terry DiCarlo taking home the win and Dave Mackey in the second spot. On our Dwarf Car Heat Races, we had Mike Cassaro win the first heat race with Miranda Chapa on her return to Antioch Speedway taking home a win in heat race number two. Chris Mello in the number seven won heat race number three. In our Dwarf Car main event, Mike Cassaro took home the win. He was followed by Josh Miller in a 22M. David Michael Rosa finished in the third spot. Miranda Chapa topped off the night in fourth and Chuck Conover in the 52M in the fifth spot. Our hobby stock heat races look like this. John Watch in the 102 and Chris Sorensen in the double zero took home the heat wins. And in the main event, Chris Sorensen doubled it up for the night with the checkered flag for the 20 lap, 20 lap main event. Michael Cooper finished second in the 57. Joe Ridgway in the third spot in the 98. Little Smitty Jr., Sid Smith Jr. in the 50 car took home the fourth spot with Haley Gomez taking home, which I believe is her first top five finish in the fifth spot in the 38H. On to the late models. Heat races were won by the hitman Jeff Decker in the 84 car and Rod Oliver in the 57, with Decker taking home the main event win. He was followed by Dennis Souza, Rod Oliver, Paul Guglielmoni, and David Newquist rounding out the top five. The Living Fat B Mods in their heat races had Casey Keller, Anthony Giuliani, and Todd Gomez take home the wins. And before we got to the main event, it was the Sharpshooter Tournament, race number three for the Living Fat B Mods. Casey Keller held off the Bakersfield Bullet, Nick Spainhoward, for the win. Spainhoward was second, Anthony Giuliani third, Ryan DeForest finished in the fourth spot, Al Johnson in fifth, and Todd Gomez finished sixth for race number three in the Sharpshooter Tournament. On to the Living Fat B Mod made event. Casey Keller led almost the entire race, but the Bakersfield Bullet, Nick Spainhoward, with a bonsai move into turn number three on the last lap, slid up the hill a little bit and was able to pass Casey Keller coming up off turn number four for the win in the Living Fat B Mod main event. Keller was second, Guy Allwart was third, Trevor Climates finished in the fourth spot, with Brent Curran following up his win last week with a fifth place finish in that 132 car. Up next, Saturday night, May 5th, 2018, at Cinco de Mayo, and we're going to have the wingless sprint cars, the A-Mods, the limited late models, the hobby socks, the dwarf cars, and the first ever at Antioch Speedway, drone air races. Don't miss it. Gates open at 5 o'clock. Racing begins about 6 o'clock. Our website at www.antiochspeedway.com, www.antiochspeedway.com for all news and notes and upcoming schedules will be released right here on my channel, Antioch Speedway Announcer on Facebook and YouTube, Wiley Wade on Instagram. Also, don't forget to check out the Facebook page for Antioch Speedway. It is called The Antioch Speedway. I look forward to seeing you there. I'm Wiley Wade. Until then, good night, everybody. Yeah.